Good afternoon, everyone. I'm meteorologist Katie McNeil. You've now clicked on the Weather Now link, and let's jump right into it. <clears throat> so taking a look outside right now, nice and sunny today. We had seasonable highs in the upper 30s, kind of right around 40. We'll be dropping back down into the 20s overnight tonight with another cold night on tap. Temperatures across the area right now still in the low 40s across Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts. 43 right now in Providence. Same in Narragansett at 43. New Bedford right now at 42. For your satellite and radar, not much has changed here. It's kind of been this rinse and repeat pattern, very clear, dry conditions. Only changes really that we're tracking for tomorrow on Tuesday are some increasing clouds with a short wave trough moving into parts of Cape Cod and southeastern Massachusetts, uh, which could bring some scattered snow showers to those areas, especially uh, Tuesday morning or overnight tonight to Tuesday morning and then again Tuesday evening and overnight on Tuesday as well. Not expecting much of an impact from this in Rhode Island directly, especially uh, uh, western Rhode Island, but southeastern Massachusetts and Cape Cod certainly could see some snow showers in the next 24 hours or so. But overall here we're staying very dry. It's going to stay that way over the next few days with no major storms that we're tracking here. Slight chance for some showers on Saturday, but overall very calm stretch of weather over the next several days. So you can see here some of these ocean effect snow showers making their way over areas of Cape Cod and the islands here. Uh, not expecting these tonight to reach far enough uh, west to impact southeastern Massachusetts and Rhode Island. Certainly can't rule out a flurry or two, though, uh, in southeastern Massachusetts. These showers are going to kind of continue on and off throughout the day on Tuesday, especially in the morning. Uh, but across the area, we'll be seeing those increased clouds, regardless of any snow showers that may be moving through, especially during the afternoon. And then the chance for showers does return again Tuesday night into Wednesday. Uh, we could see some very light snow showers associated with this or some flurries. Uh, not majorly impactful, nothing to uh, be concerned about, but just something that uh, is going to be moving through in the next day or so on Tuesday. So this evening here, staying mostly clear and dry with those temperatures starting to drop as we head towards the overnight. Those overnight lows will be in the mid to low 20s again, leading way to those feel like temperatures back in the teens for the start of your day on Monday or Tuesday rather. And here's your Tuesday morning with that cold start in the 20s, but we will warm up nicely again with those seasonable highs in the upper 30s. Again, only major change is that we are tracking that increased cloud coverage, especially towards the evening and overnight on Tuesday with the slight chance for some light snow showers, especially farther east. And as always, you can get your full forecast anytime at WPRI.com.